I was curious to know what a Roman kitchen would have been like in Scappi's day. This is the Villa Aldo Brandini in Frascati, just south of Rome. And fortunately for us, they have resisted the temptation to improve the kitchen too much over the centuries. For a cook, this is a paradise. Wow! Allora, diamo a lavorare, vai. In the role of Scappi's disciple Giovanni, I have been joined by Francesco, an assistant chef from the Hotel de Rissi. I had quite an ambitious afternoon in mind, and we took Scappi to the terrace to make preparations. I'm going to make porchetta, stuffed pig, with this little fellow. Capon meat, sweetbreads, parmesan cheese, lardo, a lovely thing to do. <laughs> Cinnamon, clove, ground pepper, marjoram, saffron, very expensive, mint, fennel seeds. Can you imagine them working together, all those wonderful spices? Wonderful walnuts, very rich. The cardinals, they were treated themselves extremely well. Pitted prunes, goat liver, bichole, freshly cooked, Morello cherries, ginger, zenzero. Today in Italy you don't use it anymore. Raisins. Another important thing, butter. Now I am in complication. Help, Francesco. <laughs> I have to help you. I don't know how to mix it. Yeah, bravo. Metti qua, metti qua, metti qua. No, no. Put everything here, this is better to mix. And we are not done yet. Sugar, a little touch of vino cotto. So now I can mix well. Francesco, ho dimenticato qualche cosa? Sì, chef, le uova. Le uova, do you see? It's a good pupil. Ah, how many ingredients, I don't know. So now we take this little fellow here. We will see what happened with him. And now we start with the filling. Mm. Incidentally, here in Rome, the porchetta that they do, they are 80 kilos. This is just a little baby. We have to do it really with sartorial skill. I am not very good in sewing, but I will try to do my best. Now, can you imagine this kitchen here? The atmosphere. Just feel it, people zousing around, peeling, cooking, preparing. We'll crisp in the crackling in front of the fire. So before he goes into the oven, I need to put a spit through him. Sorry, my friend. Yeah. Is arrivando? Sta arrivando, è arrivato. Ah, bene. He's arrived. Now in the oven. And goodbye, goodbye, my friend. We'll check and baste him from time to time, but he will need to be in there for around two hours. A quick turn in front of the fire, and he's ready to serve. Attilio is the caretaker at the villa, and he joined me to try the porchetta. Let me see this porchetta. Fantastic. Perfezione, guarda Fanny. Guarda qui Attilio. Eh? Now is the taste, the most important thing. Osaggio. Vabbè, il tuo boccetto mi mangio. Grazie. Now we will see. We will see. It is possibly for Attilio a strange taste because they don't know it with a lot of cinnamon, a lot of nutmeg and all of that. Buona. E buona sì. Delicious. I couldn't believe that a lot of sugar and all of that would give that taste. Salute con l'acqua, ma salute. He doesn't drink wine, so. Salute, Attilio.